It's exactly what. It's every stereotype. It's everything you think it's going to be. It's everything you think it's going to be. Yeah. And what's England like for what your stereotype of England was? So you've done Manchester. Honestly, it's way nicer than I thought it was going to be. I mean, it's like <laughs> it is pretty up here. It's beautiful. There's hills. I didn't. Think I don't you think you've hills. seen. I don't think you've seen all I'm the rom com, bro. <laughs> we are the Mechanicsburg of no, the Northwest. You guys, there's been one homeless guy in every town I've seen. That's pretty good. They're elected. Yeah, I, was, I saw the one guy in Manchester. I was like, "You fucking loser! <laughs> no one else is homeless, dude. At least in America, everyone's homeless." I don't know what streets you've been avoiding, but there's plenty of homeless all people. Right, all right, all right. If you come to Liverpool, we pride ourselves on having the best homeless people in the world. Really? Yeah. Are oh, they dead sound? There's a guy who wears a multicolored suit, and he's got. Uh, could you get a picture of Peter? Is that his name? Pete. His name's Pete. See, his name's Pete. You guys have so few homeless. <laughs> you know their fucking names. Oh, dude. They're, no, they're, but you'll really, see they're complimentary this, in Liverpool. This guy's a celebrity though. Like he, he so he sings, but you know, like um you know in, in in Toy Story, the thing Woody has? So it's this guy. That's a great homeless guy. This guy's yeah. not homeless. His that name is Pete. This guy's not homeless. <laughs> he, he fucking is. He used to have he's a, he, not though, he used is to have he? a cardboard he's got a guitar. Picture in the paper. He used to have a cardboard guitar and he drew the um, strings on and he said, has someone got a pencil? I've broke a string. <laughs> <laughs> and this is why, this is why I don't give to the homeless because watch their shtick. What's no, that? do you know when I walk past him, so in Liverpool, he will be stood there and 20 yards yeah. away is a real busker, a real singer. And I always give him the money because he needs it more than the guy who's got an electric guitar. Right. Show them Kensington, Philadelphia. Kensington, Philadelphia. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> is that the worst bit of Philadelphia? It's probably the worst bit. That's probably the worst bit of Liverpool as well. Of Kensington, Liverpool. Kensington, Philly. There you go. The zombies. Yeah, it's just... Zombies. I mean, it's just everybody's on heroin, so... All right. It's a street of just fucking hell. Oh, shit. Yeah. Oh, oh my God. Do you guys think you have homeless? These are... Our, that's Nancy. What song... <laughs> <laughs> There she is. Uh, she looks Do you know what nice. I love about that photo? It's clearly been taken with a ring light. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. She, she's lit perfectly. Look she's got 2.3 million followers on Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> why are they all. They're, they're not at all. That's heroin. Why are they oh all bent over? God. Not, that's nodding off. Your feet. They, they've, got, sleep. they've got incredible balance. Yeah. They're, they're like, <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> no, it's the worst place. Oh, my God. God. Yeah, bro, this is everywhere. Holy shit. Yeah, we don't have homelessness like this. No, this is what this is homeless. Wow. Je Jesus Christ. Yeah, we, yeah, look at that guy's taking We have men in lovely suits. <laughs> yeah, you guys wow. have a guy. I don't think we're doing Liverpool. Like I almost feel like Liverpool come on, we can rustle up some no, you can't, you can't touch our heroin problem. <laughs> America's Oh my the actual zombies, yeah? I mean they they they'll get you. None of them are nice either. You guys say no, you have complimentary? Nice heroin addicts. They're so mean. Oh, no, they're, <laughs> they're so fucking mean, dude. They'll chase you. The homeless people <laughs> in so Liverpool scary, have worked dude. out that if they're nice to you, they're like a bit like lovely hat lads. Don't worry about giving me money. You just have a lovely day and your complexion's dead nice. Yeah. You're like, and, and then you give them money. It's weird. Yeah, yeah. Are, they ever, are they ever mean when you When don't? you're gigging in Liverpool. No, no. Have a nice day, mate. You have a nice day. Okay, hey, Shane. You love nice live day. in Austin. That, that, it's yeah, like that yeah, level yeah. of like... Whoa. There's a guy. Give money. There's, there's a guy who sits in a wheelchair outside Liverpool Central train station. He's got no legs. When I first met him, he had one leg. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> He's since lost. Oh no! But he sits there all day and just he doesn't stop saying nice things. So he's not actually talking to you, but you'll just walk past him and you just hear, "Cheers now, have a good day. Thank you, have a good day. Yeah. Have a great day, ah. everybody. Have a good day. Thank you, guys. Have a good day." And people just occasionally will give him a pound. You would think that would, you know, all that good, the good vibes he's putting out. <laughs> Could have had a leg. <laughs> That's a fucking letdown. The thing is, the homeless in America, they'll give you a compliment. And then if you don't give them money, they'll be like, fuck you, bitch. <laughs> You're like, nice. Fucking gay ass motherfucker. You're like, all right, dude. Ugly ass girlfriend. <laughs> like, just. Well, he, blame, he blames the students, doesn't he? For the loss of his legs. Yeah, so the guy in Liverpool, I don't know this one's name. I'm going to ask him his name next time we see him. He used to go to Medicaid. He used to go to a nightclub. Do you know the queue outside the nightclub? He, yeah. He, that, he patrolled that, and the students had given money, which meant he lost his legs due to drugs. So he blames the students. Mm. No, that's you've got that slightly wrong. So he would go to the nightclub queue, 
and ask for money. And they would go, no, but do you want some drugs? Ah, oh, right. And they'd give him drugs. <laughs> okay. So now, and then he <laughs> lost- Fucking <laughs> students. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty nice. <laughs> that I've got no money, but I do have Ketterman if you want this. Oh, I thought it was And I think that is now he's like, I'd have been fine if they just gave me money. <laughs> yeah, what about, so, uh, where, does Crystal, pretty good though. where does Crystal Meth come into it? Not that I'm, you know. Yeah. I feel like Crystal Meth, in my head, I think I've watched too much Dog the Bounty Hunter and Crystal Meth is the dr I thought everyone was on fucking meth in the States. Uh, depends where you are. Or is you that are. just Hawaii? It depends where you are. Oh, yeah. that's the local. So like the Northeast, and like the Appalachian Mountains is all heroin. Right. Heroin's taking over everything. But like the Southwest is in LA, there's a lot of meth. Florida, there's a lot of meth. So those are the those are the scariest homeless. Yeah, like they're... at least in the Northeast, they're just asleep standing. <laughs> but if you get to like LA and Texas, they'll chase you. Yeah. They're, they're fast. like they're like twenty eight days later. Exactly. <laughs> That's the dude exact comparison I've used. Like we have the old Old school zombies that are like, Ugh. you get out there, they'll fucking chase. They'll be like, you bitch, yeah. and just go lock on to one guy for no reason. And they're brave. From like three blocks away. They'll be like, there's that motherfucker, <laughs> and just start. And you'll just be standing like, not me, not me. And they'll run past you. Be like, thank God, nobody helps anybody. Whoever's getting attacked by a homeless guy, you're just like, that's not me. Thank God. It's like a, like we're fucking water buffalo. Like there's one getting attacked, and we're all just like, all right, they got him. The herd keeps moving. Yeah. Have you been chased? No, I haven't. Oh. I have never been. I've, I've been like. That's why you get, you're in Northeast. Spit at. Oh. And like. <laughs> talk shit to. Like, do your face. Like, pretty regularly. Like, though, like, a guy will be like, fuck you looking at, bitch. And you just gotta be like, nothing, dude. <laughs> nothing. Please leave me alone. Yeah, the homeless, the homeless is a real problem. See, that, compared to what we have in Liverpool, is so. It's crazy. It's so different. I, it's the first thing I noticed was I was like, damn, there's like almost no homeless. So you No, they integrate a bit better. You know, they're not obviously homeless really, compared to like what he sees. Yeah, it's not like that. Yeah. Where they've got everything they own with them. No. In a doorway. That's yeah. a, hang on. Like not we're really. playing a bit, yeah, a bit of a rose tinted view of the UK. There is some. Yeah, I, you I, go, I like, believe you. I believe you. And I've probably just been in nicer areas. Yeah. But <laughs> Where did you play in Manchester? The Academy? Yeah. Yeah. So you're. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, gang? I'm Toby Pictarin. And not only am I a military vet, but I'm also a grilled meat connoisseur. I went through hell and back to defend this country. Now I'm traveling all over it to find the best greasy grub. <laughs> when I was in war, I went through a pretty traumatic experience that left my memory fragmented, but my taste buds perfectly intact. <laughs> Whoa. And sure, sometimes. <laughs> Fuck. Whoa, not cool, gang. <laughs> but I'll never forget these tasty flavors. So join me while I'm trying to remember who I am with some unforgettable food. I am the Grill Sergeant. <laughs> I'm here at Rudo's Hot House, where I hear he's got a spicy chicken dish that's hotter than napalm. Let's check it out, gang. Hey, nice work job, asshole. Hey, I'll beat the fuck out of you. I'll bust your ass, boy. It's too spicy. You don't fuck with me. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. What's up, guys? I'm here with Harudo, and this is his world famous spicy chicken. Harudo, is it? What's Harudo? Harudo. Well, I'll tell you what, Toby. It's all about the spices. Ain't that true, brother? Back in the military, we used to have a saying. Oh, <laughs> Tell me about these spices, Rudo. Yeah, uh, so we're just gonna slide in some uh, cornstarch right there. That's cornstarch. And then a little bit of uh, garlic powder, super important. Garlic powder. <laughs> and then a little bit of uh, cinnamon. Cinnamon? Yeah, it's really You're gonna crazy, make- crazy, <laughs> Rudo. It is crazy. It's really gonna make the flavors explode. Explode. <laughs> Machine, it might be too powdery. It's not gonna fry too much. <laughs> <laughs> okay? Ah! <laughs> you motherfucker! I just love the crunchiness on the outside. I know what you did, you son of a bitch! <laughs> what? <laughs> Juicy chicken on the inside. Are you so sorry. I don't really like the Chinese shit on the walls. That's why I don't wear my glasses. This chicken is unreal. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus 
Jesus Christ! It's okay, he's just having a flashback. He's doing great. <laughs> Talk a little bit more about the spices, <laughs> the cinnamon. That's a little goofy, huh? <laughs> you know what I love about this restaurant? They play loud music in the bathroom. <laughs> what the fuck, man? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Can you get back to the chicken? Can you get back to the chicken? <laughs> wow, that chicken's not half bad. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> hey, Haruna, <laughs> you can really taste that cinnamon. You want a bag of ice? Yeah, a bag of ice might help. You dinged me up pretty good back there, Haruna. Also, the spice is getting into the wounds pretty bad. <laughs> That's it for Haruto Spicy Chicken. Wow, that stuff had a kick. Coming up next week, we're headed to Denver Jesus to check out. Christ, are you all right? Yeah, I'm driving around a convertible eating pussy and sandwiches for a living. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, suck my dick. Yeah. What the fuck is your problem? Yeah. Oh, oh, that's fucking hard. Stop. I mean, you guys are fucking great. Yeah. You're so fucking great. Thanks, man. I mean that. Thank you. As much as I want to just bash you right now. No, thank you. I, you guys are fucking great. Yeah, that yeah. was uh, that was a good one. That they, is When we filmed that, there were like, there was old people out on the in another restaurant. And like when we pulled up, they were everyone were like, oh shit, it's Guy Fieri. <laughs> <laughs> and like me walking in, I was like, fuck you, motherfucker. And they were all like, holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was pretty fun. I mean, okay, a couple things. First of all, you're a very good actor, and I'm yes. curious if you if you would do dramatic acting. Just gonna ask it. Yeah, I, I've never done it. Do you train I, at all yeah, acting wise? I, I think, no. Did you aspire to do this sketch? Yeah, to do like sketches acting? in general. Yeah, 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 definitely. I yeah, I, I feel like you might be like a really like low like a sneaky really good actor. Okay, second of all, <laughs> the edit, the edit, so the edit. cute. He's so cute. I thought you were gonna, no, I, you're gonna be like low key. I think you're a little gay. No, <laughs> no, 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 dude, you're not gay at all, dude. No, I'm not gay. You're not. <laughs> not okay. Acting's not gay. Yeah, there's nothing gay about it, dude. Mm. You're not acting. <laughs> <laughs> okay, second, not. second of all, uh, the edit. You involved in the edit. I help, no, John's, he's the one that's... He's, that's, he's yeah, brilliant, yeah, yeah. too. Yeah, I like, mean, it's all that. We'll, we'll, no, film, no, no. we'll film sketches where I'm like, this Is this sucks. even funny? This yeah, yeah. sucks. And then he'll send me the edit, I'm like, damn. Yeah. The pacing, yeah. like, jumping back between the girls. Yeah. And, and then I noticed on this one, I don't even know if you did in the old ones as much, but you showed me another one as well. Using the music... That's John. It's Again. fucking... Yeah, yeah, And yeah. we asked him to be here today, but what did he say? He, he was is, too fucking busy. No, he has a job. He's a day job. Come on, John. Yeah, buy this thing so John can quit. <laughs> John. Please. Yeah, this is, we need John to quit. Everybody at home, this Wait, is, what is going this day to keys.tv. Uh, I doubt he wants me to say. <laughs> isn't, he, yeah. isn't he in then? He's, he yeah, make, he works. He works. Filmmaking, right? Yeah. yeah. Government? Yeah. No. Yeah, for a company. Um, hmm. But no, it's just fucking amazing. And it's like, it's just, I've said this when it first came out. I said it when you guys were originally doing it. I know you fucking hate the compliments, but I just want people at home to, to real, I, I think it's the best sketch out now. I don't yeah. know anything yeah. else that I'm seeing I that's making me laugh consistently. Sleep this Cop. Time. Tim Robinson. Oh, dude, Sleep Cop is great. Fucking, I think you should leave. <laughs> Tim Robinson? Really? Was it Tim? Do you no, remember Tim. this? Is it Tim Robinson? Lo Logan Paul recommended this to you. He's like, dude, this show, next up. And he said, I think you should leave. And then you, he kept yeah. on going, wait, well, what do you mean? And he goes, oh, I think you should leave. And, and then he kept going, why would you say that? We had like a who's on first moment. Like, he yeah, was like, yeah, I yeah. think you should leave. And I'm like, buddy, what's happening right yeah. now? Like, are you why mad? are you asking me to leave? Are you yeah. mad at me? <laughs> no. When I saw the ISIS Toyota sketch, I watched it mad late. Yeah. And yeah. then I, I texted you after I watched I was fucking so howling on my phone, played it on my TV for my wife and cousin who were visiting. And nice. all of us were just like, this now, is incredible. Yeah, okay. thank you. Maybe this is inside uh, baseball over comedy, but I, I don't know. I love, I love geeking out on comedy a bit. The... Um, the way that you write jokes, and there are other people who are like this, like the way Chappelle writes jokes is sketch. Like if you see like one of his bits, you can also like, it comes almost with visuals. Yeah. And I remember jokes I that- I think you said that. Yeah, maybe. The, and we did it, well. Well, the, the one joke, you saw me do a joke at the cellar and it you were was like, so that's just a sketch. Yeah. <laughs> like it wasn't even a joke. You were couple. pitching it. it yeah. I think you were even yeah, pitching it. It was just a sketch. Me. I don't want to yeah. give it away. Can we tell the premise? The premise You've we can tell. You've seen the joke. It's, yeah. it, it's at the beginning of my special. Yeah. It's, 
uh, yeah, yeah, the with, guy's coming up with age of consent. So funny. Oh, yeah. And yeah, the guy yeah. having to guess. So funny. As soon as Senators. I said it, yeah, he yeah. was like, that's a sketch. Yeah. That's why we used it at the beginning of the special. Yeah. It, it's kind of just a standalone joke. Like, it doesn't have anything to do with, yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah. You know? One thing that, like, par my parents actually asked me about, because I was just home in Chicago. I spoke about you, and then I said, yeah, a buddy of mine's putting out a special on mm -hmm. YouTube. And my mother was like, are you going to film when you come to Chicago? I said, maybe. I don't really know. I haven't yeah. decided about that shit. And she's like, you should do the YouTube thing. Can you make money on it? And I was like, well, you can, but it's also to... Yeah, get not your really. Yeah, yeah, right. Because, like, you didn't put monetization on the video. Yeah, and I thought about that. I was like, I, I wonder what's the rules. Like, what would you... Did you do it consciously, or you don't... Yeah, you didn't, I did. Because yeah. you can... You could, I didn't even add, like, a tipping option. Why didn't you do that, I, I guess? <laughs> I'm pretty Should bad we do that now? I'm bad at this stuff. Should we go back and do yeah. it now? No, it's just uh, the tipping thing. I think I don't know how much money I would have made. I think maybe t ten, five, ten thousand dollars You say that, dude. It's a bummer because you'll never. It could have been so much. Who knows? Yeah, I know. <laughs> Fuck. Watching you think <laughs> yeah. about it is great. <laughs> I'm big with content. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah, create. Yeah. I wish I could have showed. I wish I could have showed what the thumbnail of the special was going to be. That morning, he messages me that morning. He goes, "Hey, is this good?" And it's just like a picture of like upshot of his nostrils. You don't even know if it's him. You have no fucking clue who it is, dude. It was unbelievable. I have no idea what I'm doing. I thought it was. I thought it was the Netflix thing for Love on the Spectrum. True. I thought, he True. Just, it was an ups. There's no way that it was you. I had no clue it was you. Uh, I do have a bit of Michael in me. Oh, dude. I'm a big you been teddy watching bear. It? Oh, fuck, I was on season oh, one, oh, bro. Thank you. When you it came this? out. <laughs> He's been oh trying to get me to gosh. watch this. Hold on. Before Go. we get into this, yeah. there's a better one. It's called The Specials. Yeah, dude. The Specials are the, the OG. The Specials <laughs> is... <laughs> I'm so happy, bro. I'm so happy. <laughs> Yo, let me explain this story. Okay. We're talking about people with Down syndrome, yes. and they're doing reality shows about yes. this. Yeah. Okay. There's a house full of people with Down syndrome. Yes. First off, once you watch it, you realize dudes with Down syndrome are the bros. They're the best dudes on earth. Of, co of course. All right? Yeah. So this dude named Sam, he's got Down syndrome. One of the episodes, they're going to take him to a ladyboys show. A burlesque show of ladyboys. And he is pumped, dude. He's got the flyer. He's like, he keeps coming up to the camera like, sexy dancers. And everybody's like, relax. They're Australian. Relax. They're all British. No, the no, they're British. British. No, this is British. Yeah. Okay. And he goes, and then they, everybody keeps telling him. It's like, no, they're actually men. And he's like, no, they're not. <laughs> <laughs> the whole time, he's like, trust me, they're not. And then he's talking to one of the one of the house like chaperones, and he's like, "Sam, they are they are boys." And he's like, "Don't be rude, <laughs> don't be rude." <laughs> and then he, he's trying so hard. And then he goes, "What if one of them tells you they have a penis?" And he goes, "I'd be fuming." <laughs> and then you go, "Why would you be mad?" He goes, "I have no idea." <laughs> he's just like, Dude, "That's the bro." I'm, I'm still going. So he gets. To, they take him to the show. He gets in there. The camera's on him. The girls come out and are dancing. He's holding a soda. He looks back at his boys like... They show his face like, yo, I told you. <laughs> the girls are sexy. <laughs> and then uh, one, of the, one of the dancers takes their mask off and starts singing like a man. And they cut the camera to him and he's just sitting there like... <laughs> <laughs> he's still being polite. He's, yeah. And then a minute later, all the dancers come back out. The camera cuts to him and he's like... <laughs> Your second chance. Dude, there was a guy who yelled the N-word last time I was there. White or black? White. He was related to Shane, obviously. No, this was... <laughs> it wasn't, he wasn't one of my yeah. Yeah. The fuck? He wasn't one Where of my Where have you been all these years? <laughs> yeah. No, what happened? There was a comedian before me that was black that was doing a joke about fucking a white chick and her saying the N-word or something like that. It wasn't... Ten minutes later, this guy's just like, how come we can't say it? Oh, my God. <laughs> and the, the comedian had Asperger's, so he was very like, wait, whoa. Who, who, who? What? What are who you saying? What, what? And the guy was like, how come I can't say? No. Oh. And, it, and the, everyone in the room was just like, what the fuck? <laughs> and I was about to go on. I was standing there just like, show's over. And that ruined the show. He got kicked out, obviously. He, he yeah, said it yeah, yeah, yeah. once yeah, or twice, and then his wife started chanting Biden. Wait, like she, ironically, I guess. Like Biden. Yeah, Biden. he was like, "This is Biden's America. We're not even allowed to say the N word in public anymore." <laughs> <laughs> like, liberals ruin this country. Dude, dude. Liberals ruin. It. You're not allowed to scream <laughs> the N word in, in the middle of a show. 
I brought that up. Bring that up in Arizona next time you're there. It'd be like, Trump lost here, right? The whole crowd would be like, no, he did it. <laughs> yeah. Freak out. Yeah. I was like, you guys got to let him go, dude. Let it go. Did you mention it when you came back home? Yeah, I did 10 minutes on it. What'd you say? You have to. Just like, hell Michael yeah. Richards just went for it. <laughs> hell yeah, brother. Started to show for the bring it. Harry Cruz would wail on you. Dude. Terry Crews, if you're Cruz watching this, would. I feel like I could beat you in a fist fight. <laughs> dude, that's, if I had to pick a celebrity, he'd be like one of the last ones. No, I'm kidding. Terry Crews would absolutely kill me. <laughs> um, I, just want, I, just wanted, I just wanted to pop off and say something nuts. <laughs> yeah. It's like, clearly Terry Crews would kill me. I've been taking shots at The Rock, dude. You think you could beat up The Rock? I'm fuck The Rock up, dude. I'm sick of him. Who would win in a fight, Terry Crews or The Rock? T the Rock. The really? Rock. Yeah. Wait, why are you sick of him? Uh, well, it started a long time ago. But I was hung over one day, wake, waking up in a hotel, and I just, you know, looked at Instagram. Yeah. It's just a rock. It's like disrupting in my iron paradise. <laughs> I was like, dude, fuck this guy. Shut just up. Every, I was just like, shut the fuck shut up, Shut the dude. fuck up. Good God. Yeah. And then he posts, like, cheat day videos. Yeah, and it's He's like, like, I earned this. And he just eats cookies and shit. It's like, dude, <laughs> dude go you're... Fast and Furious movies in the WWF. Fucking shut up. relax on yourself. Dude, yeah. you were the worst part of Moana. Shut up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. A lot of people think he's going to run for president. Would you vote for The Rock? Yes. It depends. Is he going to fucking secure the border? Yeah, yeah it depends. Is he going to lock her up? Because <laughs> in that case, I'm all... Lafayette, Louisiana? Sure. Lafayette, Louisiana. Please. Whoa, <laughs> you fucking okay? burp. What the <laughs> That's the promo you this get. great promo. <laughs> the <guy. laughs> no, I have, I have massive acid reflux. Lately, you have. I have it. I get chunks of like things that I ate like yesterday come up. Mm. Oh, like just now I got. Oh no, dude. cilantro. What oh. did you eat? I had a burrito yesterday. Mm. <laughs> dude, you guys <laughs> fucking disgusting. Tapeworm, <laughs> lies, <laughs> acid reflux. <laughs> so gross, dude. And they fuck. Oh, man, we I'm sorry. We you're fuck. not. You're very. <laughs> fuck, fuck. You're, no, no, no. You obviously. I don't think you, you know, liked it. I was kidding. I don't pop thing. lights on my head. Go ahead. I'm probably. You're right. <laughs> A lot more disgusting than him. I like he does not like he is Christian sex. Like I I go for it. <laughs> Hell yeah. yeah. Do you have Christian sex? Yeah, obviously. Look at <laughs> kind of like a YouTube special. I really don't have other options. <laughs> <laughs> I know. But do you like experiment in I mean I don't want to get too He doesn't. You know what he said to me yesterday? I was like, "Hey, did you like it when we had anal?" And he didn't even remember it. Do you know how heartbroken I was <laughs> that I put myself out there in Do you that like way? anal? Uh, it's fine. It's yeah, it's neutral. It's the, fine, right? It's fine. It's yeah. I, but you that's not your go-to. It's like No. It's not a crazy. Like if there was a menu, right? And you got to choose one thing yeah. as your entree. <laughs> sure. Anal sex wouldn't be. But you didn't thing. even no. remember it. It didn't even clock in your like. It didn't. It wasn't stored in your memory. Bank. My appetizer would be making out, right? Yeah. Yeah. Nice yeah, make out. You right? Right. That's nice, right? Nice make out's uh, great. My entree would be what? Missionary. Missionary sex. <laughs> yeah. Class. About two minutes. Two minutes. Yeah. Yeah. Two minute mission. And our dessert Hopefully. would be in the eyes. <laughs> oh wow. Yeah. That's pretty good. Master, you know, just you know, what I mean, coming on the face, sweetie. You don't even have that in you. <laughs> Well, it's tough to get up there because you're down, you know. Yeah, I know. You're a missionary. Thank you. Thank you. And you're staying in as long as you can. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. I don't have time to crawl up crawl there. Crawl up there? Right. Yeah. So, I, you know, I hit me this mid. Yeah. This <laughs> belly. Yeah, yeah. 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 So and I, then you, you, for dessert, you say, did you come? <laughs> and then she goes, right, right, right. And she goes, no. And you go, that was. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You got to work on that. You should come next yeah. time. I mean, do you do? <laughs> Will you like experiment and go? Let's sixty nine it or yeah. Every once in a while, I'll toss in a good. <laughs> so anything where I'm laying, yeah, yeah, it's pretty easy. Yeah, <laughs> because I'm more of a bottomy guy. Kind of, are you bottomy or? Well, no, I don't think. Yeah, yeah, you're a toppy. I'll get up there. Yeah, you'll get. Up there. <laughs> I'll get up there and ride a little. He doesn't at all. More stringent about web web uh, security too. Yeah. Who the fuck is this guy? There's been a guy that's been banging outside the door and this, screaming this, this entire is time. Fuck. It's another wop. True. I mean, we're right next to a kitchen, too, so. True, the wops ah. are in there. It's a me. Yo, yeah. you gotta... Shut up, oh, you guinea. Rush. The rush is on. <laughs> they live for the rush, dude. Gardini knows. Gardini worked in a fucking Italian restaurant. Oh, yeah, restaurant. you worked in an Italian pizza shop. Yeah, dude. I worked for wops, too. They do love screaming. They fight, oh, yeah. they fight all day in the freak, kitchen. Dude, they freak. They spaz every day. Dude, they're ridiculous. <laughs> Your wife's a moulinian. <laughs> All right, that's my last black joke. Ital no, Italians do say that. It's good. I know, yeah. I know. I've seen the movies. Classic Italian joke. Yeah. Which means eggplant, I believe. It does. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. 
Was there another it's one? It's just, just continuously just happening. The WAPs just keep checking in on the room. Yeah, they, what well, they heard they nosy, heard they heard more and yawn, and they're like, <laughs> "Are we partying?" <laughs> Dude, if you gave a girl a karate chop on the butthole, not as hard as you could, obviously, because you'd split her in half. Yes. But if you did like a, if you did like a quick fucking <laughs> to the butthole, they would probably do something. I mean, yeah, if you can split them, <laughs> they'd probably you can do split brick. I could split a brick. <laughs> I have no doubt I could split Girl's a, butthole would be nothing. Girl's butthole would just... Yeah, dude. Give me three You'd stack buttholes. three of them on top of each other. <laughs> <laughs> and they'd all just come at the... Oh. <laughs> That's probably what all girls really want is to be cut in half from the butthole. <laughs> um, Ma'am. I hit Ma'am? my I hit my girl with a funny one this morning. What'd you get her? You would have liked it. She What'd came in the room. It was She was looking for her laptop. And it was in the bed. And I was like, what do you want? And she goes, my laptop. I go, when do you want it? She goes, now. <laughs> and I go, what do you want? She goes, my laptop. <laughs> go, when do you want it? She goes, now. <laughs> it's a fun little trick. You can get, a very good You trick. see somebody looking for something, hit them with, what do you want? When do you want it? And then they go, now. <laughs> and then you start a chant. You go, what do you want? <laughs> On Hopeful Advice with Bobby, Kalila, and Shay Gillis. Uh, the first question is not a question. It was actually a common um, request on our Twitter and our social media, uh, people are saying you have an amazing, surprisingly, Donald Trump impression. Oh. And they wanted to see if you could teach Bobby how to do the Donald Trump impression. He's tried it a couple of times. Can I hear yours? I don't have one. Yeah, you try, try to do it. Try. No, you try, you try, one first. I'll mimic you. <laughs> you try. First. No, no. No, you go first. Well, just give me a okay, sentence okay. that he would say, and then I, maybe I'll try. Uh, let's go. Uh, uh, the, greatest, uh, the greatest country in the world is America. The greatest... The greatest country in the world is America. Okay. <laughs> that was terrible. <laughs> <laughs> that was terrible. That was terrible. That was like, that was like Marlon Brandt. <laughs> America. I know. Great. <laughs> well, I mean, say one, do the same line, right. and maybe I can mimic it. So you got to do the easiest way to do Trump is like the speech Trump okay. when he's doing a rally. Trump. Okay, okay. Because it's just in the back of your throat. Okay. The greatest country. <laughs> That's it. The greatest country. Okay. A little bit. The, the greatest country. Don't do this. Do this. Uh, the greatest That's, country. Don't move at all. Only yeah, move your hands. All right. Don't, don't move my body. If you're sitting, don't move your shoulders. Just uh, your right. hands. If you're the sitting, greatest country. Sit like that if you're sitting. Don't. First of all, don't. Okay. So sit like this. <laughs> don't. Yeah. The greatest country. The best country. The best country. <laughs> Wow, what, what a country. <laughs> wow, what a country. A lot of Asians. A lot of, a lot of Asians. Maybe too many Asians. Maybe too many Asians. Too many Asians. <laughs> yeah. Maybe too many Asians. I don't know. Really awesome. That's pretty good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was good. Let's see, he gets Who that definitely straight guy. Oh, the guy wearing before a, he even talks. The guy wearing a hound tooth <laughs> leggings suit. Jimmy said that Michael said this was a. I first don't believe person. a word of anything in this documentary. Okay, 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 hey, Wendy. <laughs> That's just like Michael Jackson in the Dude. audience clapping. That is the greatest. Oh, you think he was gonna side go that side? I swear to you, because I was I was about to say the words. I go. How could they be clapping for O? Yeah. <laughs> yeah guys dress like Sergeant Pepper. Yeah, they really they do. Fucking they, dress like, yeah. they dress like fucking Dominican warlords. Uh, I don't know. Is he, at a, is he in the FAU band? Why is he, <laughs> is he going to drum line? Uh, Why is okay. What's up? <laughs> ah, okay. What's up? Oh, trick Daddy provides a Trick Daddy performance on Wendy Williams. He just comes out late. Aha. Uh -huh. What's up? Shut up. <laughs> To the they big are. domes, shut all. <laughs> yeah. They are a hot <laughs> to couple. The <laughs> to, to the little boys that got fucked, oh, shut up. Oh, I'm not autistic. You don't think at all in the spec? Have you ever taken a test or something? No. For it? No. Why not? How take an know? autism test? Yeah. 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 What's the should, test? I think you should take one. Do you fucking panic at malls? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. If you told yeah. me people with Asperger's panicked at malls, I'd be like, yeah, it makes sense. Yeah, yeah sure. Flow out. of conversation can be tough sometimes. <laughs> 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 I think you guys it's are our fault. fucked up. It's our fault. Yeah. Look, I'm one sorry. On five. One on five. Yeah. What do you want me it's to do? Definitely one on what five. What do you want me to do? I just entertain. All right. Man, I fucking love Avengers. <laughs> <laughs> Is that that hard, Shane? Is that that hard? Finally. You turn it on when you want. Yeah. That's all you it piece takes. piece of shit. Because <laughs> oh you're acting God. like we've never hung out on a not podcast before. Guys, mm. I'm having fun. 
I'm glad that you makes won. one of us. I'm the glad time of my won. life. I'm glad. You Dude, what else? What is the podcast normally like? Huh? Uh, we, sit, we bring up a thing, then we bring up a race, and then we say how it's connected. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Avengers is like Mexicans. Why, guys? Uh, they just keep coming out with more. Yeah, they, they're all yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank this you. Is this is good. Nice good. good formula. Yeah, that's yeah. fun. It's like I like improv. that. <laughs> what else you got? Or we explain why stuff is gay a lot. We like yeah, that. We oh, love that. That's, that's See, dude, this is a, this is my wheelhouse. Why aren't we doing this? Yeah, Some yeah, yeah. Jokes? jokes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't yeah. say roasted. Buddy. Yeah, that Come might on. be a little Come bit on. insensitive. Roasted. Yeah, yeah. yeah. let's <laughs> do a different one for that. <laughs> <laughs> Bullying. That's better. Bullying. <laughs> okay. Um, but yeah, that's basically the formula to what we do here. You know, and yeah. then maybe we'll have an interesting conversation about a YouTube video that you saw that week. Yeah. Mm. Right. Something that taught you something about the world, and then you know the guys will probably support it and encourage you to bring up more conversations. What other movies? Are like we, races. <laughs> no more movies. I like the movies and races. <laughs> I'm just realizing right now you're fully fucking autistic. Yeah, <laughs> I, totally, I yes. never knew it. No, I never yeah. knew it, dude. No, he's, Why is he normally drunk? And that uh, probably unlocks his, like, his personality, his humanity. Yeah, or you just chalk up any of the weirdness to being drunk. You're like, oh, oh, I just fucking drunk. That's yeah, why he yeah. stared at me like this for like 30 minutes. Right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he put his tongue on my elbow. <laughs> <laughs> this whole time I just thought he was making fun dude, of me. He all I want to do is go home and play video games. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I'm thinking about. We brought the video games to I you, know. baby. Oh, you want to see autism? <laughs> <laughs> You're about to see it. <laughs> what other movies? So... Was hmm. your dream to go to the NFL? Uh, no, Were you that I knew. guy? No, no. You knew? You knew. When no, you got, I knew when you got to Army, early. did you know, or in high school, did you know? In high school, I knew I was not going to Oh, good NFL. for you. Yeah. Most guys don't. I ran like a 5'7", 40. I was like, I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> this is it. That's so slow. Wait, so what if someone... It's, so it's <laughs> crazy how it's, slow yeah, it is. What's so average cool. for someone that position? The position? Now, they run like four nines. Yeah, now, it's terrible. Like, it used to be oh, It used to be like a freak if you were like 300 yeah, yeah, on a 4'9". Yeah. Now, there's four nines it's, every year. It's and it's they're 320 slight. pounds. So no one's running seven. a fucking it's, five. That's Yeah, they, no, they, they are. They are. They it's are. stupid oh. they even make them run 40 yards, yeah. but there's, there's Isn't it a lot of it, your lateral motion too, the side to side motion that they Definitely. For old linemen, yeah. yeah. The 5'10", five, 5'10". Five, yeah. yeah, the I ran like, I, w I went to this combine at West Virginia and ran easily the slowest 40 in the entire <laughs> combine. <laughs> and I was just like, I, you it's know, so embarrassing, I'm done. Because you run, oh, they're all. It's so embarrassing. Because everyone knows there's a whole group, yeah. and they're like, five, seven, yeah, seven. You're like, yeah, 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 and yeah. you're all, fuck, damn. Yeah. There was just a slow twitch muscle over here. It was so <laughs> slow. <laughs> oh, nice. Well, Shane, you got any more, you any, are there any other hard hitters? What? I was asking uh, Shane if you had any hard hitting questions for you. I think I think there was one rumor about you where people were dumping on you through hammocks. Yeah, is that true? A sexual thing? A sexual thing? Yeah, where people were taking shits on you. A sexual thing, right? Yeah, sexual yeah. sexual dumps, not like just like you know, not like sanitation. Gross what, what the fuck? This is <laughs> this a rumor. I just want to ask. Well, no, I'm, I'm saying. I think it's who cool. cares? What I the think fuck it's business awesome. is it if anybody's? If it's true. a sexual thing, good God! Do I did I ask you? About your sexual life? Yes, I mean, almost immediately. Have you ever, have you ever literally licked, immediately? Have you ever licked an asshole? Yes. I mean, yes. have you sodomized another human being? Yeah. And how do you feel about that? You I'm know? pretty excited and, and, about it. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Fucking, none of your fucking business. What I do in bed? Nah, I, I promise you. Chair, I promise you. If we were to divulge me and my present and past. <laughs> Wives, girlfriends, and associates, the truth of our sexual relationship, it would make that sound so fucking kindergarten. That's yes. awesome, dude. All That's right, awesome. You're talking about you've got dumped on from higher up in a hammock and had the mega. Oh, Jesus Christ almighty. <laughs> Wait, but you got you guys know who Hans Kim is, and you guys like traveled here and you're like, hopefully Hans Kim takes a liking to us. <laughs> what a sad fucking existence, dude. <laughs> That suck. You know you're better than him. You know that. Yeah. Don't get tricked. I can you guys dumb you to as Bobby shit. Lee. Are you guys dumb? Come on. <laughs> Wake up, idiots. Took almost everything in me to not open the fucking trash bag and eat all the dude. Food. What was their excuse? I don't know. I've seen plenty of black men eat half a, a meatball sandwich and take that thing back home. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Save it for later. Respect. I say that respectfully. I've seen that yeah. happen many times, dude. You work construction. Yeah. Black guys typically have half a hoagie on them. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. At any given moment, I would see so many dudes when I when I was in the labor union. When I'd work for my dad, they would like 
eat half a meatball sandwich and just chuck it in their pocket. And they're like, oh, my wife's going to love this sandwich, dude. <laughs> <laughs> you know, they'd have like a fucking hot meatball and a, and a fucking <laughs> half a hoagie all day long. Yeah. Just in the back, just fucking wrapped up and just be like chiseling concrete. I'm like, damn, my wife's going to love this. <laughs> and that's happened enough for me. To, I can say that with respect. Yeah. Like, that's you know. And once you pick up on that, you'll notice it. Like yeah. you'll see if you pick up because a lot of people, you don't realize it. But if you're just walking down the street, you'll see a black guy drop a sandwich almost every day. <laughs> They'll come out. I'd be like, ah, shit. I'm going to have to pick up a pick up a wrapped up Subway sub. They stay with one half hoggy on them at all yeah. times. Yeah. Where do they store it? Yeah, pockets. in a plastic they have shopping a ton bag. Of pockets. Yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah, dude. Plastic hey guys, that's why they always wear baggy clothes yeah. <laughs> to accommodate their hoagies. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, they stay strapped with that witch, dude. They yes, got that witch on them at all times, dude. <laughs> it's dangerous. So that would have been respectful. You guys could have fucking pocketed your sandwich. And that's why they're always so ornery. Oh ornery <laughs> because they, they know that they have fragile stuff on their persons so True. if you like bump into the max yeah, like, or you must, or you must <laughs> cost me a fucking sandwich yeah if you step on their shoes like yo you almost crushed my sub bro. that's why they keep randomly <laughs> knocking out people in new york <laughs> you get too close to the sandwich i watched an asian lady get <laughs> popped on the face oh, today dude you get you get a hit you see one of them get hit they can pick up their bros like you're bleeding through it's just the marinara yeah. sauce <laughs> <laughs> coming through the jabot <laughs> <laughs> do you gotta cut deli you gotta, paper rip yeah dude if they get yeah. hit by a car you gotta cut the jeans <laughs> off and get yeah. to the sandwich <laughs> <laughs> that's an italian that's I, got, I got an italian sub you know how many italian subs save their lives dude think of yeah. a guy in an er and some nurse like he's unconscious <laughs> she's like cutting it and she's cutting it into bread like what the fuck <laughs> that's why the cops are always pulling him over just trying to, oh, what? Just trying to commandeer. Yeah, I knew I was going to get off the uh, yeah. yeah, they want a free sub. They're going to oh, confiscate cool. the Let sub. Let me patch you yeah. down. They're fucking, <laughs> oh, fuck yeah, dude. What's this? That's all yeah. cops eat are commandeered hoggies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they love it, dude. Yeah. Oh, dude, you're 100% you right to that. take this back to the station, test it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they, they, they take the hoggy and they're like... <laughs> legit <laughs> that's the battle between who loves hoagies more than <laughs> cops or old black dudes <laughs> <laughs> oh my god jesus oh, christ shit. Um, so saturday night, saturday. <laughs> but this way i wanted to show you this so that you are you know just like well informed I just added bug to my list of pronouns, so here is a very quick tutorial on how to use bug bugs pronouns yeah. in sentences. Okay, let's go. I'm meeting up with my friend Moth later. Uh, bug just dyed Bug's hair and it's this super cool green color right now. I think we're gonna go to Bug's house and play some video games. And then I think Bug said that Bug wanted to go to the store by Bug's self. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done, dude. If my kid fucking grows up and makes these TikToks, I will beat the shit out of him. Hey. I will fucking yeah. take his head and beat it on the desk. And I don't care. I don't like it. <laughs> done. Look, I'm out there. That's great. <laughs> done. What, uh, what would your dad say if he saw <laughs> but If my dad saw this? <laughs> yeah. I can tell you exactly what he would do. If you played that for my dad, he'd go, what the hell? That's it. That's as far as he could go. He'd go, fuck is this? He would just be. This is a different planet. I'm. I'm losing touch with this. This yeah. is. What, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's a like. I'm getting old enough where I see this and I'm like, I'm out. Yeah. yeah. I can't. I don't get it because it's. It almost to a degree. I think you kind of go like, oh, I get. I get what's happening with they. <laughs> like when someone goes, I'm not he or she, and you're like, okay, but then you're like, wait, you're bug. <laughs> That's not. And yeah, when the my favorite is uh, you <laughs> want to go buy bug self yeah. to the store. <laughs> I mean, all you have to do is read this with like a hillbilly accent. It makes perfect sense. Yeah. <laughs> I think we're going to go to Bug's house, play some video games. Yeah, I think Bug said Bug wanted to go to the store yeah. by Bug's self. Yeah, it's true. Like, it does make sense. Yeah. But also, then you realize it's not, Bug's not that person's Bug's nickname. not that. Yeah. No. I don't think this person is. I think a lot of these are just people with. I think disabilities. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this woman has a disability. Yeah. I think you're right. Yeah, I think you're or this right. bug. I, pardon me. Bug, bug self. Well, that's the thing is like, it just sounds I knew to me. someone named Scutterbug. Where? In Virginia. Of course you <laughs> did. Yeah, bug. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. I think it sounds to me like this person wants a cool nickname. Right. Maybe not True. a pronoun where we have to conjugate 
Yeah, but you can't give yourself the whatever. cool nickname. Exactly. You can't, up, you can't show up to school and be like, guys, I'm Bug. Yeah. yeah. Everyone's been calling me Bug. I'm Snake. I ain't afraid of him. I ain't <laughs> yeah. afraid of him. Nobody yeah. called him Snake. I was, I was doing an all black show in Philly. Yeah. Black as hell. And uh, <laughs> this one, there was, there was like one white dude there. I, I did notice him, but I didn't notice anything about him. Yeah. And I got on stage and the, the he was kind of to my right, like behind me. And he just was like, <laughs> He just started sneezing nonstop, and I was like, "Yo, could you shut the fuck up?" <laughs> I looked over, and he was he's mentally handicapped. He was like, I'm so sorry. And I was like, "No, dude, dude I'm sorry." And the whole crowd was just like, "Ooh." What about when you? And I was like, "I didn't know he was fucked up." And then I was like, "Ah, oh, my bad again." Yeah. What about the Magoobies table? The Magoobies. <laughs> is you called insane. me after the show. It is ins- so I was at Magoobies in Baltimore. I'm going to be there at the end of this month. Yeah. And uh, go get tickets. There was a there was a guy there was a table of mentally challenged dudes. It was like a day out. That's big day out. That's my demo. (laughs) They love them. One flew over the cuckoo's nest, got tickets, (laughs) and then (laughs) this I couldn't see because when you're up there, spotlights, you can't really see. So I saw a shadow of a dude holding onto a woman's shirt, getting led out to go to the bathroom, and I was like, "Yo, you guys see how fucked up that guy was?" Uh And everyone was quiet, and I was like. All right, why? Well, who cares? The guy's <laughs> fucked up. And I kept saying fucked up instead of drunk, which would have helped. Yeah. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. you're giving old terminology. He goes, did you guys see that water brain walking yeah. to the bathroom? Yeah. And then when I saw him come what? back in, I could kind of see their face this time. And I was just like, oh, oh shit, no. this guy is very mentally challenged. Oh, no. And I literally was like, I mean, in front of everyone, I was like, you see this fucked up guy? Oh. And everyone was like, no. But yeah, that kid, that kid, he's down to 260, was 400 some pounds, never been on a plane, has, you know, has a shit job. He, you just feel for the kid. He's like, I was like, are you yeah. making money? He's like, I make $17 an hour, dude. I'm balling. I was like, Fuck, it's not bad. Where's he from? From America. He's from Chicago. Oh, Chicago. It's pretty good money. But uh, he went to, he's never been to the comedy store. He like looks up the comedy store. So I called Emily, got him tickets, front row, right? Booth uh, at the comedy uh, store. No, nah, it wasn't a booth. It was like the table right there. And, uh, the table's right on the stage. We were the first table front uh, row. beside that. Yep. That's awesome. So he's never been. And then, uh, he, I'm flying him from Chicago to San Antonio. My show's next week. To oh, hell yeah. 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 So he'll be with us in the green room. Oh, fuck yeah. yeah. That's yeah. amazing. That's exciting. Yeah. yeah. That's a super nice kid. Yeah. yeah. Really super good nice. kid. So cool. Yeah. Is George Harris super the super sweet kid and he credits Brendan for changing his life. He literally said he changed his life yeah, I told him to him lose weight and all that stuff. Yeah. <laughs> what else? No, that's awesome know? though. Yeah. All right, so sounds like a real fucking downer. If <laughs> <laughs> that sounds terrible. <laughs> Is it in the green room? Just like, uh... it just starts crying. Yeah. I'm like, I'm like, I'm gonna go out there. You sit tight. Quietly you sit there. He's like, I don't feel good right now. Yeah. I'm a little sad. Wheel? Yeah. It was, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Shane is a liar. I want all the fans to know Shane's a phony. Shane likes me and is very sweet. I love and then he comes him. on he the show. You. He's a, a cocksucker. But in life, no, I, get oh, it. I heard the joke. That's how you responded, you <laughs> fucking dumb dickhead. I guarantee you missed me. <laughs> I called Shane. Right. <laughs> don't pack it too tight. Right. You're packing it too tight. Now right. you're going to actually hit me. Put your hands by the side. You don't throw it too hard. Hands by the side. I can't. The hands are if right. I throw it too side, it's going to the ground. No, 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 I can't throw it too hard. Go ahead. Oh, boy. What do you guys think? Can I hit him or not? I believe you're in definitely you. gonna. Yeah, he's Shame. too tight. Is that a loose ball? No. He packed. It I think. He's, I think. He's no, no, if he's, I tried to throw this hard at his now face, it's got to be target. Yeah. What are you gonna hit? hit I'm saying so his forehead, left, forehead. Hit his left, your right tit. I'm not trying to do it. So hard. all your anger hit in his left eyeball. Oh no, Wait, oh, Lewis, no. Lewis, <laughs> Lewis, Lewis. It's, <laughs> you can't move. I gotta be able to. It's play. not a. I gotta be able to squint. Get him in the chops. Just close your eyes so you won't know what's coming. You open your eyes. Open your eyes. Close your eyes. Open your eyes real wide if you don't believe. I'll tell you what. If you don't believe that. I'm gonna hit you in the eye. Open Shane, your eyeballs real Shane, wide. Hold it open like this. He's not hitting you in that eye. You gotta back up as far as you can, Lewis. He's not hitting you in the eye. He's not hitting you. Hold your eyes open. He's not hitting you in the eye. Believe in something. <laughs> yes. Shane's a pussy. No, no, no. Shane's a pussy. No, 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 no. Shane's a pussy. Just open your eyes, baby boy. Let's go. I thought I can't hit you in the Shane, eyes. Shane, no <laughs> chance he hits you in the Zero. eyeball. He's going to probably hit the glass. Shane, I promise you. He's not I was the one who eye. made the fucking bet. Shane. This was my idea. Stop it. Let's I said, I won't move. I bet you don't hit. Yes, dude. Oh, no. Yes, you're you see that coordination? studio, bro. <laughs> 
No, I'll let you throw it, but it's so close. It, you open your suck. eyeballs. I'm not opening my eyeballs. Wait till you see. <laughs> what are you afraid of then? I'm afraid of you. Wait till you see my eyeball. fucking way. Because you know I have dope fucking throwing. That's the only thing that could look, look, throw look, look, quarterback. That's show me, love me. It's show me your throwing motion and throw it at the door for a second. Just show me your throwing motion. Aim for the middle panel. Middle panel. Okay. <laughs> dude, oh my dude. god, Shane, hold your open eyes open, your man. Hold it open, eyes dude. Open. Hold it open. That was insane. He missed dude. it by three feet. <laughs> <laughs> That's long, wider than the door. He missed the width dude, of the door. I would have hit the. That would have hit oh, the table. Even, I could have imagined. <laughs> That was, that was a 50 he's like, cent. He was, uh, he's fighting his range right now. That's yeah. off, dude. Oh, just you hold, hold on, throw it at my face. I'm not open. I'm not. Shane, you back up as far as you can. Lewis, let us just sit. Yeah, hold yeah, your yeah. Uh, one eye. Hold it way open. Just one eyeball. <laughs> one eye, dude. It's so hard, dude. Like this. Real big. Yeah, but if you fuck my eye, I'm fucked. <laughs> dude, there is no, I got no way, way no he hit your Shane, eye. No Did you see zero percent throw? All right. <laughs> you get one eye. You get one open eye. Don't fuck my eye up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking up <laughs> Do it while you're laughing. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> you're shaking up his eye all open. <laughs> Is it funny? <laughs> Hold your eye open. There's Come not on, a chance. Clockwork though. Orange style, baby. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all that Target. Look at that real estate, Lewis. You got so much. Lewis, Lewis you got to focus here, man. Oh, you got to focus. To a tight Lewis, end right put there, on Lewis. Eye of the Tiger. Lewis, remember what <laughs> the stand did to you tonight. <laughs> remember what Bobby and Alex and Who's Jordan a shot Dan Lewis hurts himself throwing this? And all those cab drivers, Lewis. All I'd of say them. Think of all the cab 50, drivers, 50 dude. Shot. There is equal likelihood that Lewis hits himself in the yeah. end. No chance <laughs> yeah. I see it's you in Closing the eye. my eye with You guys got to time this because you got to see where no, it hits. Dude, you got to you pin it open, dude. Obviously. Here we go. It's going nowhere near you. Oh, Lewis, man. come on. This is everything you've worked for. You're not standing? I can't You're believe do you think seated? there's a chance over this, Shane. I'm oh, so no. confident. <laughs> If There's anything, not, his hand's gonna cut it's gonna, it you in. You gotta back up, Lewis. You gotta back up as far as his, you can back up. His hands might act as a backboard, though. Yeah, oh, yeah. Here we go. No, you gotta hold it open, no, dude. No, you gotta hold it open. Hold it open. That was, that like was the deal. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> no, that's there gonna, you go. That's gonna block it. <laughs> no, it won't. No, you, you gotta hold it. too tight of a rim. Hold it open. Yeah. Shane, you gotta hold it open. Yes, perfect. That's perfect. Oh, that's good. Go, Lewis. Becky, can you please get a close up shot of Shane's face with his eyeball open? They did. They are. Lewis, come on. It's great. Come on, come on. <laughs> with no with chance, dude. With we should just do. We should just go Lewis. back and forth until one of us hit the other one in the eye. <laughs> yeah. I think that's bad radio. Oh, God. Oh. That was not a bad arm. shot, forearm. though. Hit his forearm. Lewis was within a foot. I closed my eye, though. I do believe. You cheated, dude. I do believe. Redo. Need to get a do-over. Redo. <laughs> <laughs> do you see now you have nothing to worry about? Uh, go, Shane, go. Yeah. Okay. Wait a minute, Shane, play, Shane played sports. No, I, I played. No, he doesn't know how to play sports. played offensive line. I can't throw. Yeah, he doesn't know how to throw. Here we go. Wow. Lewis, your eye looks oh, wow. fucking terrifying. So big, dude. It's so big. Come on, bro, eye for eye. Like dude, it's, it's so big. It's so big, dude. <laughs> So easy to hit. Oh, oh, you blinked too. You blinked. I was close. Watching my first strip club in ten years. Really? Yeah. You do all this cool shit with Lewis. I think that's. Like, yeah, yeah, I know. It's Lewis. It's Lewis. Thing with it's me. Lewis. It he wasn't. Lewis. You gotta be. Here's the thing. You gotta stop being such a beta bitch with Jay, dude. You gotta just fucking say, I don't care. Oh, oh, you're a beta bitch with Jay. Guaranteed. I know what you're doing. Jay, is he a beta bitch with you? Does he do whatever you want to do on the road? Guaranteed. Lies. Lies. I live my own. I stay after. They fucked up by myself. Yeah, he stayed. He stayed out past. I go eat pussy by myself. No. Goes and eats pussy. Pussy. I do eat pussy. Let me smell your breath. <laughs> okay, I believe it. That's the way that he fucking did that. I believe that was even pussy. But check it. Good for Teddy, over. dude. He fucked both of you guys? Oh, yeah. He got me good. How'd he get you? Didn't pay me for the work I did. Told me he was sending me home because I wasn't bringing the fire on his microphone. But it was because... <laughs> It was because earlier that day. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Were That's you, on you, dude. Were you or were you not bringing the fire on his? Did microphone? you bring the fire? I did well, actually. <laughs> did you bring, <laughs> you bring the, the fire? fire? <laughs> I, I don't know if I brought the fire, <laughs> but I did well. Uh, you're, I, 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 you're, I, I did okay. No, dude. It I was. It was. Fine, it was. It was, it was me. Fire. It was me. It was me. And don't laugh at the name. He's a very funny guy. Cool Bubba Ice. I was opening for Cool, cool Bubba, Bubba Ice. Ice. I was opening for Cool Bubba now, Ice. He, now, Cool Bubba Ice, breathe the fire. Oh, he brought the fire. 
but cool by the way this guy ran the show he was such a shitty like dude he's the owner of the club and he would like host and do 30 some minutes up front and then like 15 20 in between it was like brutal so i actually did well because of the timing of the show Cool Bob Ice actually had a rougher time because, like, it was the crowd was already there for like two plus hours. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. he was getting a shitty time. He's hilarious, Cool Bob Ice. Um, but he, uh, the second day we were there, there was a padlock on the door in the middle of the day. <laughs> and it was like that they owed like 15 grand in rent or something. And so they, uh, they sent me home and said it was going to bring the fire to the mic, but it was because he couldn't afford to pay me. What was it, a mix of... Sweating to the old days. Sweating. Remember that when was things the were racist? Yes. Let's lose weight to that, to the good old days. Were the songs racist? Yeah, of course. All songs were racist about that. Like, I heard it... Rock Around the Clock? What do you think that's about? Time is up. Yeah. On You Know Who. Mm-hmm. Emmett Till. <laughs> <laughs> it's not that kind of song. That's the, well, that was the subtext that kind of, of the show, song. Man. Sincerely, Dracula. You know they're coming out. There's a new Emmett Till movie. I saw the there's trailer. trailer with yeah. Will Smith? No. Oh damn. No. The mom. The mom is the main character. She what does that mean? It's about the mom being like, you have to show the pictures of my son, even though it's like scary. Yeah. And horrific. Open casket. Yeah. Mm. She wants the open casket show so world. everyone knows. Who's in it? Who plays Emmett Till? Um. Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. No, I, I, I already fucked her. I already fucked her. They're like, hey, Beetlejuice. Did you fuck her beat? Did you whistle at my wife? I already fucked her nine times. I fucked her 20, 30 times. I probably, I probably, I probably fucked her nine, nine million times. No, I never fucked her. I never fucked that bitch. She's just fucking, she's thinking he's beating him to death and he's not reacting at all. In time, the cotton gin, but he's just at the bottom. I'll whoop your ass. He's at the bottom of the up in your ass! And he's just not dying, they don't understand. We dragged him behind the truck for 45 miles. He said, no, I'm, 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 I, had, I had that truck. I he drove said, no. fast as hell. I drove, I was, I was NASCAR. I drove that truck to NASCAR. The strip club, it was so fucking, Lewis bought me a lap dance, which was very sweet, with a girl who's gorgeous. Too gorgeous to be interested in giving me a lap dance. Yeah. And I hadn't been so in a strip club, so I didn't know, I know, I know they're not. <laughs> <laughs> but she wasn't even putting on a so weird. She's this girl was in love with me for a song. A it has to be her like idea. Girls in the strip club aren't even interested in me. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> That's why I don't go to strip clubs. I would never assume any of them are. They of are, course, dude. You're great. You're, yeah. strip, you're a strip. You, you like are the embodiment of a strip club oh, song. Dude. Lewis said something so funny. Oh. I was in the zone, dude, at my strip club. When she danced, when she I danced tried to make out with one. Yeah, you I did. Like, was going for it. I, I kept sure. being like, "How much money do I have to give you for us to make out right to now?" Kiss? I know. And she you was trying like, to offer the money exactly. to kiss her. She was like, "Are you trying to kiss me?" And I was like, <laughs> "That's pretty much why I'm here." <laughs> I was just in the strip club looking for kisses. <laughs> 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 kiss the kiss the last the old old man on the planet. Man, uh, I'm gonna head down and get some smooches just over an at the. Uh, man, like, I'm gonna be honest. Several men have given me money to blow. That's them. literally what she said, dude. She's like, "You're like the first guy I've ever heard say he wanted to kiss." You're the first guy that's especially since my mouth. Kiss covered in other guys cock <laughs> yeah, yeah. what was her price uh she would she refused and then i was blacked out and then beezer gave me an adderall <laughs> you're back in the game that was all she wrote no yeah. then, I, then ray gave us a ride home and, uh, <laughs> and then that, if people saw that photo <laughs> like in ancient times they'd be like it's a demon it looks it's like a, a demon. i look like a guy who somehow got fat in a concentration camp <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what is that? kept stealing all the extra gruel. <laughs> like, what the fuck? I just uh, had like nine hats. I'm like, how oh, that fat guy get nine hats? <laughs> this guy's killing it in here. <laughs> Damn. True. Oh, man. Yeah. I like that idea of just a entrepreneur in a <laughs> concentration <laughs> camp. They were just a there. Gary V in there. A couple people were, couple people were doing it up. Just a pure Gary V in a concentration camp. Like, you need to work hard. <laughs> I'm going to outwork everybody here. Yeah, that was chronic. That's not, that's not a great bit. We apologize. We've got a few crushing. more days of goofing. Shout out to the Jews, dude. I love the Jews, man. I do. Nice. I love the Jews. That's good. I've been doing, uh, doing a lot of research. The Shout Jews rule. I've been saying, listen to the old we, we've cast. We've been saying, don't, you know. Call I, me, I have. You already said my body was disgusting. Don't make me an anti-Semite. First of all, we both know. Jews. <laughs> Jews, Jews do rock. They rule. They rock. They rule. And they, no, they rule hard as fuck. Yeah. I only turn. I didn't. First off, I never. We've talked about this. I don't never, know how to frame this conversation this way. We can just say they rule. <laughs> no, but I never knew cared about Jews. True. Then all of a sudden, I moved to the big city, and everybody's got an opinion on Jewish people. Mm. 
Which is strange to me. Up in that was in New York. Here too. Any that's, city. That's what you Statue go to of a Liberty city. was originally donated for. For what? The light. It was supposed to let him. <laughs> oh, I'm kidding. <laughs> it was given to us by the French, but. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm I know. Yeah, I'm joking. <laughs> uh, <laughs> fuck, I forget where I was going with this. New anyway, Jews rock, dude. <laughs> I saw a homeless lady reading the other day. It made me laugh. Really? <laughs> she was she was reading. She was sitting there like covered like blankets set up everywhere. She what was, was she reading. reading? 48 uh, Laws of Power? Yeah, she was reading The Art of Not Giving a Fuck. <laughs> <Really>? <laughs> no, I didn't get to see what she was reading, but it was it made me laugh. I was like, pretty funny. Why don't you get to work? Tucked up with a book? Stop reading. Yeah. So it's funny to finish a long homeless day and be like, I'm going to settle in with a nice <laughs> book. <laughs> I was thinking, because we were, me and uh, the fellas were working on that King show. We're trying to, we're, we're working on, we're writing, whatever. Beautiful. But I was, I was talking to John yesterday. It'd be funny if, Anytime we introduce a character, you know how like in any series you add characters and they leave, they come and go. Yeah. Every character that leaves the show needs to kill themselves. <laughs> There's never another way that somebody leaves the show. <laughs> Every character eventually kills themselves. It'd be funny. <laughs> Just building up the circumstances to why they have to do it would be so fucking yeah, funny. Yeah, cause, yeah if, the, if the viewer knew that they were going to eventually, <laughs> you just slowly see like them drop a cup and be like... <laughs> like just the whole time small things bothering them immensely especially the medieval suicide methods would be so nothing but self guillotines oh dude even though yeah entering the iron what's like the thing they put on those like a yeah, iron maiden where you just stand there for a fucking one month <laughs> i'm killing myself <laughs> just <laughs> oh the one with nails that you close oh you ever see jesus that one? christ dude yeah. they did some wild stuff they were bad boys. The boys were up to no good. They were bad boys. I wonder how tolerant they were of other people, though, in terms of like people's beliefs and oh, I'm sure they were very lifestyles. <laughs> no, they put them in a fucking <laughs> nail bed. I've never had any really big dick injuries, to be honest. This I've had my, small dick injuries. This is injuries. my first. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah, this is my got, first. This is my first penis injury. Did you ever do a penis crash? No, what's that? It pops out. You go you just like jam yeah, yeah, jam it, yes. lady. Yeah, yeah. See, yeah. that's what happened. Except this time there's a fingernail there. Ah, yeah. You had Normally, the, you had yeah. the, the and then mythical. The girl always, yeah, that's funny. What? We both talked over each other three times in a row. True. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that, it's like that, the that. opposite of a harmony. Like, <laughs> so what were you saying? I'm sorry. You're no, saying, you go ahead. I was saying you encountered the mythical vagina dentanta, dude. Yes. A tooth vagina. <laughs> True. She tooth. could have it, and she lied about her hand. <laughs> she, yeah, she is a, a demon. Rogue, you got a rogue tooth in there? The vagina dentanta, dude. <laughs> Folklore by the Native Americans. God, dude, you like that one? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, she's gonna be delighted to hear this. What? About she's a, this whole ordeal. Yeah, yeah. Well, Whatever. yeah, that can go one of two ways. Sometimes they can get like, oh, you know, you're joking around, but you were just joking around about you getting sliced. Yeah, my penis was cut. Yeah. Anyway, hit, hit you with that hill razor, dude. <laughs> Did you have to call for new sheets? No, it wasn't like that. Towels. I was just like holding no. a fish. Yeah. yeah, I I gripped it. <laughs> you like, oh, it? You it turn it? Yeah, I really did. I applied it tight. <laughs> yeah, dude, I was worried. <laughs> dude, I I was like, no, it's not bad. And then I went, Just I ran in the into the, squeezing. I went to the hotel bathroom and I let go for a second. I was like, it's actually pretty bad. <laughs> <laughs> it's very bad. <laughs> so Fun. yes, that's good. Well, now Glad you guys know my secret. I have a damaged. Can you fly with a damaged penis? Uh, I'm going to go through that. They're going to see it. Like, the- Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, step aside. Step aside. <laughs> step aside <dude>. Something's wrong. <laughs> you're hiding something in your penis, dude. <laughs> Probably thought a cartel. If they do opened. just randomly select me and they're like, we have to touch you there. I'm going to be like, no, my penis is actually cut. <laughs> <laughs> you're not going to be able to go in the ocean in San Diego. I was I didn't plan on it. No, that'll heal it <laughs> out. Bro. Think me and uh, <laughs> Lou, you're going to go swimming. <laughs> you might. Yeah. Dude, that will heal. That'll heal you up instantly. Yeah. You need salt water on that thing. You think salt water is good for my wounded peen? Yeah, like I'm, I'm dead yeah. serious. That would heal it. Guys. You could salt. Dead. If you have some Himalayan, dude, you could, you could, you know, get I'm not a salting start. the wound. <laughs> you on my penis. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mike, penguins are only at the South Pole. Hold it out of the link. <laughs> Apparently, early Virginia, they thought that the, due to the latitude, they thought that it was the same climate as the Mediterranean. So when they came here to uh, Virginia originally, they were like, sweet, we'll grow like bananas and olives. 
and the, all their food just oh, failed. Dang it. And all they had to drink here for years was just water. <laughs> they did not have Sir, food. everything but the slaves has died. <laughs> <laughs> all right, next crop. I don't get I don't get it. So they had banana plantations in Virginia. They which tried. Is, it, which it, is it, a swamp, right? The crop didn't take. Yeah. Oh, there's some party <laughs> animals outside. Awkward. Yeah. 